Good morning, my Virgo wins. Happy whatever day. Happy Friday. Happy Friday. It's going to be spring on Monday in the Northern Hemisphere and fall in the Southern Hemisphere. Are you guys ready for these seasonal changes? I know I'm ready for spring. Um, I'm it's a mess this week if you've noticed i'm just chasing the energy that's how i'm getting the readings out and so i just did pisces you were featured pretty heavily in pisces so you were obviously the next sign so i do apologize um it was six readings yesterday and six today so but you know what better late than never and there's probably a reason why your reading is being done today rather than tuesday all right, Tarot the Mystical Moments for the main deck. I have Light Sears Tarot for the clarifying deck. The links to these decks can be found down below in the description box. Three of Pentacles and Lovers. Who's in love? Feels so new, but it feels so strong. I, You know what song I got when I was shuffling this? is Secret Lovers. You know, see, I don't want to sing. You guys don't want me to sing. Three of Pentacles and Strength Card, uh, Leo Energy somebody in knight of pentacles i feel like somebody with that capricorn energy the three the four of pentacles the two of pentacles somebody is just holding on to you or you're holding on to them or both of you are holding on to each other like you're their last lifeline it's just kind of like where did you come from you got the lovers king of swords and the sun virgo whose reading is this my virgo's in love and my nose is itching i love it all right, Virgo, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus, Virgo. If you are a Virgo, know a Virgo, feel like being a Virgo. Virgos, I'm glad you're here. You can be a Virgo in this resonates. You can be dealing with a Virgo and it can resonate as the main story. And Virgos could be the cross watcher. This reading could be about a Virgo or for a Virgo. Take it as it resonates. All right, let's move it down. Okay, all right, what are the messages for the Virgos that need to come out today? What's the message? What's in the air? Like Phil Collins, in the air, t is it in the air tonight? I wonder are all these songs popping into my head. Okay, what is going on with the Virgos? What is the energy for the Virgos? The Justice, Lady Justice is here, Libra and energy, commitment, contracts, what's influencing the Justice? What's influencing the justice? This is like, if this is love, this is a person be like, I know I'm gonna marry you. It's that kind of, it's that kind of stuff. What's influencing the justice card? Soul contracts. What's influencing the justice card? What's influencing the justice card? Knight of Pentacles reverse. Okay, so who's overthinking? Knight of Pentacles reverse can be a card of Neg it could be negative thinking, overthinking. Um, it reminds me, when I see a Knight of Pentacles reverse, it reminds me of a Nine of Swords. Somebody's overthinking something. Okay, what's the reason for the reading? What's the reason for the reading? What's the reason for the reading? You got an eight, overthinking. That's what, I, that's what I felt, Eight of Swords. Do they have to leave something first? What's in the past? What's in the past for the Virgos? What's in the past for the Virgos? You got the sun. But I feel like you brought this to this person and maybe they felt like they couldn't change their situation, but they're willing to change it for you. I know it sounds corny. I feel like I need a cheese alert banner. You know, hit a button and go cheese alert, cheese alert. Oh, it sounds cheesy, but seriously knight of wands and the six of wands look at that fire energy i feel like this person it, it feels like a person that has a lot of walls and a lot of reasons to not choose happiness and they overthink something and they worry about the worst case constantly they could be given a box of chocolates and they're going to worry it, it, it's it's a lot of overthinking but I feel like you're tearing down somebody's walls. What's on your mind, Virgo? Knight of Swords reverse. There it is. Ace of Swords reverse. Virgo's not playing with this. And a Page of Wands and a Chariot. I feel like Ace of Swords reverse can be a lack of communication or no communication. Knight of Swords reverse can be cutting something out. Knight of Pentacles reverse can be Virgo not working on something telling you maybe you're walking to get this person to finally talk to you finally reveal 
and maybe that's what's going on here is you know they have feelings for you you they, they probably are really sure that you have feelings for them but they were i feel like they were hiding it they didn't want to deal with it they didn't want to face it so who pulled out whoever pulled out is getting this person to come forward because look at the chariot and the page of wands now we're in our heart space now we're in our our instincts we're out over the head and into the heart space that's what i feel here what's in the near future actually i feel like that's in the peripheral over here because i feel like this is what's triggering this person to finally act what's in the near future what's in the near future for the virgos what's in the near future for the virgos What's in the near future for the Virgos? Ten of Pentacles. Virgo. I think you put somebody out in the cold. Did you put somebody in their transformational box? Kind of feels like that. All right. Justice influenced by the Knight of Pentacles. Yep. Eight of Wands and the Lovers when I split the deck. Virgo, Virgo, Virgo. I really feel like you're tearing down this person's walls. And you're not even trying. You're not trying. I feel like it's, look at the two of cups that you guys are so disgusting. There's too much love here going on for my table. Okay, what is the justice influenced by the Knight of Pentacles? Reverse. The justice influenced by the Knight of Pentacles, reverse. Libra, the justice. What is this justice? This is somebody that, I mean, look at this. We got the Queen of Swords. We got the Knight of Swords. We saw the King of Swords, Ace of Swords. This person overthinks the shit out of things. And I feel like you got tired of it. What's the justice? What's the justice here? The page of wands. It's it page of wands is exciting. It's invigorating. It's something you didn't even know. I feel like you are someone this person didn't even know they need until you pulled away. What's what's the Knight of Pentacles reverse? Knight of Pentacles reverse. And the Six of Wands reverse which is the minor arcana card of the chariot so you're just like you know what if you can't talk to me if i'm feeling breadcrumbs if i feel any kind of way especially a justice reverse i'm pulling away which i feel like you do it's because you do that it triggers this person to come forward what's the eight of swords reason for the reading gemini energy what's the eight of swords eight of swords overthinking yep here we are with more swords knight of swords both Gemini energy. And you know what? If you think of soulmates are two halves of the same whole. I like to think of a soulmate as, you know, uh, two whole people coming together. But if you look here, Virgo, you are a magician and half of you is a Gemini. Half of the magician is uh, Gemini and the other half Virgo. I feel like you found your other half here, but they didn't want to see it. They didn't want to acknowledge it, but they, they can't deny how it makes them feel. What's the sun in the past? the judgment reverse the page of cups reverse and the two of pentacles two of pentacles is being open open to try and that's why i feel like you and there's that three of pentacles we saw i feel like somebody laid it out and said i'm open to try this i'm open to see where it goes it's judgment reverse and the page of cups reverse i feel like that made somebody pull away i i really feel like they were afraid of how they feel Ace of Swords reverse and the Knight of Swords reverse on your mind. No communication, no kissy kissy. No kissy kissy. What's the Ace of Swords reverse and the Knight of Swords reverse? Cutting that out. And the two, Jesus, can we get any more swords? Now twos and tarot talk about a decision between two people. You're making a decision that this person didn't want to make. Two of Swords reverse is saying, you know what? If I have to, if I'm feeling a little bit anxious, it's not worth my time. It's just not worth it. I'm not, I've been down this road. I'm not going down this road any further. I feel like you pulled out right in the beginning. Take that as it resonates. It might resonate with you dirty birds, but let's just keep it moving. It's not terror after dark. 10 of pentacles in the near future. 10 of pentacles in the near future. Virgo energy. Here comes that commitment. 10 of pentacles in the near future. Virgo energy. Is that Gemini finally getting that air sign, getting their act together? Ten of Pentacles in the near future. And the Six of Pentacles. Here is the offer. They're like, I'm so sorry. Six of Pentacles is a reach out. It's a, a, it's a real offer. 
It's a real freaking offer. Why? Tell me about the Ten and the Six of Pentacles. You're dealing with somebody who overthinks. They, they'll overthink everything. But you, you know what though? You making that decision to really stand up for yourself, put this person in their heart space. And that is where they're deciding things. When they're like, no, I can't let Virgo go. I got to get on my snail and catch them. Virgo, how far away? Come on, Virgo. I, are you with somebody else? Page of Wands, huh? Are you? Are you? No, this person doesn't want to see you with anyone else. Six of Pentacles, Ten of Pentacles, near future. And the devil reverse. Finally letting go of some. You know what? Was it a toxic connection? Was was there a toxicity around this person? But you know, there's a little footnote I'm catching with okay. If you look up the devil reverse, there's a little bitty footnote on this card. Uh one of the meanings is can't change i can't get over something i can't let it go i tried i can't let it go i'm getting a bit of that i'm getting this person can't let you go they don't want to let you go they refuse to let you go hangman reverse is releasing of something else and it could be this person's walls it could be another connection but they're it's it's similar to the Piscean read pisces reading as i look at the ten of cups reverse um, that I just did. It's just living without you is not an option for this person. But I feel like if you had to show it to them by taking away your presence and they missed your absence, honestly. So yeah, you, this person is willing to do what it takes to get you back. And I don't feel like this is like, I mean, I don't want to sit there and label I don't feel like this is a real past past energy. I just want to put this out there. But you know, for some people, it might be. So that's why I don't even know why I went down that lane. This really feels current to me. That's what I'm trying to say. All right, Virgos, before I confuse this any further, I hope you guys have a fantastic weekend. And I love you guys. I really do. All right, take care. I'll see you guys later.